team coverage continues now. A Starville Church member who was also shot is sharing his story of survival tonight. Kid Kids Frank Jefferson sat down with him and shows us now how he's embracing what he calls a second chance at life. Starville Methodist Church. For years, just a quiet place where the community came to worship. Two months ago, all that changed. When I got shot, it felt like hot coals, you know, burning through my body. That's Mike Sellers. He was one of the people caught in the crossfire that fateful day. Expecting, uh, you know, the preacher's the one who had the gun, but when I opened the door, that wasn't the case. After finding a fugitive hiding in his church, Pastor Mark McWilliams drew his firearm. But after a brief struggle, the man overpowered McWilliams, killing the pastor with his own gun. God needed his help for something, you know, a higher calling because uh, he was such a, a good and great man that, uh, that uh, I think he was needed. Soon after the pastor was shot, the gunman attacked Sellers. Sellers was shot six times, four in the back and two in the front. The most serious wound, right here, because it punctured an artery. I could have bled out, and you know, why didn't I? It's uh, like it was some, some divine intervention going on there. Grateful beyond words for having another opportunity to live. God kept me alive, had a purpose, and uh, I, I feel like, uh, you know, got a second chance at life. Another chance to spread God's word and carry on Pastor McWilliams' legacy. And that was Frank, Frank Jefferson reporting.